Kushiro Wetland, the largest in Japan. Wetlands are fast disappearing all over the world. Fortunately, Kushiro is registered under the Ramsar Convention on Wetlands. Located on the northern island of Hokkaido, the wetland covers over 200 million square meters. It's believed the Kushiro wetland took its present form over 3,000 years ago. The bountiful waters of the wetland nurture over 2,000 species of wild flora and fauna. The wetland is generally cool. In winter, the temperature can drop to minus 30 degrees Celsius. The mating dance of Japanese cranes. To Neo Hayashida, has spent 30 years observing Japanese cranes and working for their conservation. His six books of photos depicting the lifestyle of the crane are universally acknowledged for their high academic value. The number of Japanese cranes declined to 33 at one time. Thanks to preservation activities, we've managed to increase their number to 700. A forest surrounds the wetland. Blakiston's fish owl is known as the guardian of the wetland forest. Sumio Yamamoto has been working to help this bird avoid extinction. Their number has fallen to 100 due to increasing development around the wetland and the decrease of fish, which is the main staple of the owl. We believe that creating and conserving an environment that the owl can live in is sure to lead to the creation of an environment that is also pleasant for humans. Keisuke Saito is treating injured Blakiston's fish owls at the request of the environmental agency. He helps the owls recover and return to the wild. In the past, the forest around the wetland was harvested for lumber or cleared in the name of development. Twenty years later, some mountains still show the scars of logging. Volunteers are planting seedlings in an effort to restore the natural environment. Creating a forest means large amounts of rainwater will be retained in the earth, improving the nutrition in the river waters and increasing the number of fish. It may take a hundred years to bring back the forests that were lost. We may not be able to see the rebirth of the forest during our lifetime, but we want to do all we can right now. Some species of plants are found only in this wetland. The lady of the wetland blooms for just ten days in June. Yoshihito Sato's internet homepage features the Kushiro wetland. He's been updating it every day for the past two years. To halt further destruction, I believe that the first step is to let people know that places like the Kushiro wetland still exist in Japan. A regional association sponsors eco-tourism for small groups, emphasizing the importance of the wetland. The association has invited many students from overseas. They learn about efforts to conserve the environment, preservation of wild flora and fauna, and ecotourism.
Chiro wetland is a magnificent example of the harmony in nature. This diverse environment, rich in wildlife, is a treasure for future generations to cherish.